Morning, folks. Welcome to day... I don't even remember what day it is. Day 11? Yeah, I think it's day 11. Welcome to day 11. Um, so this video is all about... It's it's the, it's the, the three news, because I have three things that are going to be new that are also news. Get it? Yeah. Little play on words there for you. You're welcome. Okay. <clears throat> so... Your project is due today at 7 p.m. Um, you are turning, when you turn in your project, you have, you, so you have all day today to work, um, and you need to turn your project in by 7 p.m. today. When you turn your project in, yesterday I sent out some fun certificates, which I'm really excited about. So when you turn your project in correctly, um, you'll get a little certificate from me that says, you did it! Good job! Um, and I'm using that as a feedback email. There is no exit ticket today. You're welcome. Happy Friday. Um, so all you have to do, all you have to do, folks, watch this video, and then at by 7 p.m. today, turn in your project. I'm very happy about this, folks, too, because people have been sending me so many emails with their work for feedback, and I, uh, it's just so cool to see you guys, and we're like, what? you guys have turned out for this project. It's very pleasing. It, it is very exciting to me because I'm weird and a nerd and I'm your crazy science teacher. Whatever. Okay. Anyway, I get excited about flip books. That's fine. Moving on. Um, so yes, you need to turn in your project by 7 p.m. tonight. Um, when you turn in your project before the deadline, you will get a certificate from me that says, you're awesome. You did it. Congratulations. You're done for the week. Um, you are t what what you are turning in to Google Classroom again. You are turning it in to Google Classroom, not email, not Google Hangouts, not on the stream. You are t you are clicking on the Classworks button, and then you are clicking on the View Assignment, and then on the um. On the right hand side of the screen there is a button that you click to add links okay and links and files whatever and there are two things that you need to turn in one is your models whether that's you know two videos five videos 78 pictures I don't care how many I don't care what gets sent to me um, but your model of meiosis and mitosis needs to be linked that's just that's one thing and then the second thing, of course, is your turn in form, okay? If you have not already done that, please do that today. Um, and if you are doing it on paper, you can take a picture of your turn in form and link the PDF um, that you take to the assignment. Or you can download the form digitally, fill it out, put your name on the title, put your name on the title, and then link it in that way. Um, Speaking of names, so that's the two things that you're turning in. Again, you're turning in your project, the actual model, and you are turning in the turn-in form. That's why I called it the turn-in form. You're welcome. About that, make sure, make absolutely sure that the name of each file that you include has your name in it. Okay, if it is a Google slideshow or a Google Doc or whatever, that's really easy. Just make sure that it, ha it has your name in the title of the document. If you are linking a PDF or a video, um, find the file, hit Control click, and then it should give you a little menu that says Rename. Okay, you can also click on the file like three times in a row. Um, and that will let you rename the file as well. It's really important, folks, that you put your name to the file that you are linking so that I know which is which. I'm gonna get I'm gonna be getting 79 different assignments today, and I wanna make sure that I know who is sending what. Okay? So that's all of your information about the project today. Do it 7 p.m. You have all day to work in it. Um when you turn your project in, I will get I will, and you do it correctly. I will send you a certificate that says you're awesome, with a little personal message from me. Um, you're turning in your model and your turn-in form, and make sure that you have your name 
on everything that you link to the assignment. Okay? All right, so now for some new news. Welcome to News Channel with me, Miss A. Okay, first new news. We have a slightly new schedule, okay? So um, if you haven't already been told, for this next two weeks of home learning, um, you are getting four, four days of work per week. So it's like you have four days of work, but you have five days to get that four days of work done. Hope that makes sense. For simplicity's sake, I've been telling people to just follow like the Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday schedule. So that means that each week we will have just two sessions of science, um, 120 minutes of work that you can do. You can take as long as you need to get that, that work done with a, with a couple of um, due dates that um, you need to follow. The second new news is um, I am changing the way that we are doing exit tickets to make it easier. You're welcome. So um, I got really frustrated because apparently I can't like I can't upload your grades that I've given you on your Google Forms to Google Classroom. I would have to go in and like type out each and every single one of them. I don't have time to do that. I'm working very, very, very hard. Um, so <laughs> to make it easier on me and to make it slightly easier on you, um, first of all, there will only be two exit tickets a week. One will be due on Wednesday morning by 7.30 a.m. Right when I start work. I remember, I'm available from 7 a.m. to 3 p.m. Um, 7.30 a.m. to 3 p.m., okay? So, um, the first exit ticket of the week will be due on Wednesday by 7.30 a.m., okay? So you have Monday and Tuesday to get that exit ticket done, and we have Wednesday morning to get it into me. Um, and then the second exit ticket will be due Friday at 3 p.m., so end of the end of the school day by 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 Friday. And that kind of splits up the week. Um, <coughs> excuse me. You can do your exit ticket sooner. You can turn it in really any time during the week. Um, but the exit tickets are to be done again after each science activity that you do. Okay. Um, the exit tickets are no longer going to be Google Forms. They're going to be a Google Doc that I link to an assignment. So just like the um, just like the turn-in form, you'll have to go in and make your own copy of the document, type up your answers, and then link it and send it to me. Um, we're going to get into the rhythm of doing that, folks. So um, those exit tickets will kind of let us practice what it really means to like turn turn work in on Google Classroom. Um, so that's the second new news, the new exit ticket way. And then this, the third new news <clears throat> is going to be that we are starting a new unit after next week. Yay! Um, we are getting done with um, cells and DNA, and we are going to be starting our new unit, which is going to be evolution. I'm very excited about it. So um, next week is going. you have an assessment that finishes up cells and DNA. We've also got a quiz alize, just like normal, um, that we that you'll do to practice your um, your or to test your knowledge before you actually sit down and do the assignment um, to, to do the assessment. So and then next week also after you get the, done the assessment, I've got a Cosmos video that you get to watch. Um, so yeah, so there's that and it's going to be very exciting. Um, that's so that's all of the oh yeah so after next week that's when like at the end of next week that is the like that is when we are no longer going to be talking about cells and DNA and the following week week five next week is week four this is the end of week three so the start of week five that is when we are going to be starting our new unit of evolution okay so it's really 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 important folks that um, if you are behind you take next week to get caught up okay this is your this is this upcoming week is going to be your breather week it is important that you take responsibility for your education and you get your stuff turned in all right i think that that is all yeah yeah
coffee. That's good. You guys rock. Oh, also, there's going to be a there's going to be a surprise for you today. So make sure you, your only hint is make sure that you show up to math class, the Zoom meeting that Miss Fish has scheduled for you. Make sure that you show up, okay? So there will be a surprise. All right. I think that's all, folks. You rock. I'm here if you need feedback. I'm here if you have questions. Remember, if you don't know how to turn things in, there's a, for, there's a video in the classroom that shows you how to do that, and I've also explained it in this video. Get that project done. Get ahead of schedule so that you are ready for next week, okay? Peace, folks. Rock and roll.